If you are shopping for a wheelchair or scooter ramp, you have a vast selection to choose from. In this video, we will go over the different types of ramps that are available for wheelchairs, scooters, and other mobility devices. The first question you should ask yourself is, what length of ramp do I need? The length is extremely important. It will determine how safe and easy to use the ramp will be. Start with finding the height of the rise. The rise is the vertical distance you are traveling. You can then input this number in inches into the mobility ramp calculator found at discountramps.com. This will give you three different numbers. The first number is the length of ramp you will need for commercial access, such as ramps for public buildings. This will be a very gradual slope and the easiest to use. The second number is the recommended length for residential or vehicle access of occupied wheelchairs or scooters. The last number is also for residential or vehicle access, but for unoccupied wheelchairs or scooters. These numbers follow the Americans with Disabilities Act guidelines. You can find out more about these guidelines at www.ada.gov. The next important question is, what type of ramp do I need? Mobility ramps are very diverse, allowing you to find a ramp for your specific needs. They come in five basic types, non-folding or solid ramps, folding ramps, track ramps, threshold ramps, and modular ramp systems. Non-folding ramps are generally shorter in length and are used for smaller rises. They do not fold but are the easiest to use. Folding ramps come in two styles, single or multi-fold. The single fold models fold in half down the length of the ramp. The multi-fold models fold down the middle both ways to be about one quarter of the size of the full ramp. Both types usually have built-in carrying handles and sometimes go by the name of suitcase ramps because of their resemblance to the luggage carriers. Track ramps are used for manual wheelchairs and some types of scooters. They are two separate narrow ramps that can be positioned to match the width of your wheelchair's wheels. Their design makes them smaller and more lightweight than other ramps. Please keep in mind that they are not recommended for six-wheeled power chairs or three-wheeled scooters. Threshold ramps are smaller ramps used for doorways and other short rises typically under six inches. They come in a variety of materials, including aluminum and hardened rubber. Modular ramp systems are large permanent or semi-permanent ramps. Many of these systems are made of lightweight, rust-proof, and extremely strong aluminum. There are a few other things to keep in mind when choosing a mobility ramp. The first is the width of the ramp. This will be specified for each ramp. Make sure the ramp is wide enough for your mobility device, leaving a few inches to spare. The final thing to keep in mind is the weight capacity of the ramp. Add the total weight of the mobility device and its occupant, then compare that to the ramp's weight capacity. If another person will also be on the ramp assisting, be sure to include their weight in your calculations as well. Experience the joy of regaining freedom and independence when you have the help of a mobility ramp from DiscountRamps.com. With a huge selection to suit all your mobility needs, DiscountRamps.com has the right ramp to get you on your way.